how are server cabinets a part of the containment solution? Well, the best way to tell you is to show you, so please step into okay, the, the pod. This is a demo pod of a 6x6 six six configuration. These are the sub-zero arctic enclosures, right. the server cabinets. Understanding where you're going to get the best containment integrity, air integrity for your containment, it starts right at the, the uh, server cabinet itself. So they're absolutely integral to airflow management. Absolutely. And so some of the key features that's really important to maximize air integrity for the space, um, and we'll go through a number of the different things here. Uh, we find uh, our common configs are 42U, 45U, 48U, 24 wide, 30 wide. Uh, white has been a predominant demand and request just to lower lumen requirements within infrastructure. Uh, this front door, you can see it's kind of a unique form factor and there's a reason behind that. Uh, not only does it have the highest perf pattern in the industry, but the form factor also allows for the IT assets hosted inside to have a little bit more wiggle room to uh, accommodate. Uh, the other nice feature, this is a standard server cabinet comes with locking, uh, mechanism or our swing handle locks. Uh, we also have combination locks, but we're starting to see more and more people graduate to a higher access control for mm -hmm. the rack layer. And this is a biometric uh, card. Oh, very cool. Thank you. So, so lots of really unique features for the server cabinets from Sub-Zero. Very customized. Um, honestly, Everything that Sub-Zero does, they, they look at trying to create that comfort and convenience and simplicity in design is always going to be uh, a big hit. So what we've done is trying to complement the air integrity and have the server cabinets complement containment and likewise containment complement the server racks. Uh, so some of the, the key features that you're looking at here is to maximize through point the only airflow you're going to see allowed through this because of different design features, and those are our air, air dam features, we've isolated and eliminated any recirc or, or bypass air uh, and unwanted thermal load from the IT assets uh, coming back into, into the inlets. Uh, so these are your vertical rails here, and as you can see, if this was fully populated, there's only one throughput for supply air and that's through the thermal load of the IT assets. So down below we have a, a removable toolless air dam and on the vertical rails we've also isolated and secured uh, any leakage point there. Uh, also on top we have that accommodated as well. So again, if this is a fully populated server cabinet, there's only one place for airflow to go flow through. So that's from the front side of the server enclosure. There's some other features that I'd love to show you that's on the, the back side. Let's take a look. Okay. Well, we walked out the door and around. Here we are at the rear end of the server cabinet. What's unique for Sub-Zero here in this space? Jackie, let me show you some of the features that we have in the rear of the cabinet. Everything that you can see here is very configurable, easy to relocate, and it's simple. Um, you can see we have everything to account for and handle all the cable management demands for day one. So that is a, a, a constant challenge for ITN users to ensure that the, the bounds of network cable, power cable is clean and secure. Mm -hmm. uh, without doing that properly, you're actually going to impede uh, the proper flow of the thermal load and exhaust from the server. So, this is a configuration of a 50-50 configuration, uh, A and B power split equally, but this can also be rearranged and re reconfigured in the field simply. Uh, so Each unit, very customizable. Absolutely, it's, it's easy to relocate and configure per the site commands demands, but uh, the other key feature is that day one, everything is equipped and ready, so you have that comfort and convenience with a sub-zero enclosure that's also complementing air integrity for your containment strategy. I um, assume that's very important for the client. Absolutely. And I then the roof is special as well. It, the roofs that you're looking at here for the top panel, uh, this is easily uh, can be, if we're in a, another environment where it isn't an aisle containment strategy, 
and say rack containment is the uh, containment strategy they want to move forward with. Uh, there's just a couple screws to access, remove, replace, and then our telescoping chimney. The, the, the timeline to install our chimney rack containment system is better than anybody in the industry. Awesome. Well, Sub-Zero Server Cabinets, yet another easy, efficient, and very cool part of the containment system. Thank you, Joe. All right. Thank you.